गुड मॉर्निंग मैम मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड आई एम फाइन थैंक यू वी हैव लर्न सेंटेंसेस इन आवर प्रीवियस क्लास रिमेंबर यस मैम इज अ सेंटेंस मैं गणेश यस शिवा a sentence is the arrangement of words and letters in a proper way not letters how letters are arranged words 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 mam can i say yes dia a sentence is a group of meaningful words very good sentence is a group of meaningful words which are arranged in a particular pattern yes adidev the arrangement of words Uh, in a correct way. Very good. So these are called sentences. Okay. So in the last class, in the or in the previous classes, we have learned the <coughs> sentences are divided into subject and predicate. Yes or no? Yes. Then we learn that sentences, the three important components of a sentences or the three important patterns are subject verb, object, subject verb, complement. subject verb and adjunct yes or no remember today yes. we are going to learn four kinds of sentences or four types of sentences okay four types of sentences which we use in our regular life okay does anybody has any idea about these four types of sentences everybody close keep the book close okay anybody has any idea no no okay do you know at least that whenever we speak we speak with some emotions in our heart not heart we and have like describing some... and describing will be there no not like that see sometimes i will say emotion how are you i am fine so what is was that what was that what did i ask him how are you Which it's a type of sentence. So which it will be a question? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. So I'm asking a question. It's a sentence now. A type of a sentence. He said, "I am fine. I am fine." He said a statement again, right? It's a sentence. Chris, wow, that's a nice name. So what is now? It is an expression, a sudden expression. Wow. With an, with an, with an exclamatory mark. Exclamatory mark or exclamation mark. Yes. Or can you also switch on your camera? What is this? Uh, question. Asking. No, Ask. it's a comment. Command. Yes. Request. Command. Don't. I didn't say request. I'll say if I have to say request. Please switch on your cameras. It's a comment. Oh, okay. I said can. Can you? You are. I'm giving you an order, a command. Never tell lies. Advice. Warning. So these all set of sentences comes under types of sentences. Okay. So today we are going to learn four types of sentences. Ma'am. The four types or four kinds of sentences. Yes. And the test, sir. Yes, I will be conducting the test in the second half. in the evening okay so the four sentences are the four types of sentences are the first one declarative sentence the first one is declarative sentence what is the first one declarative sentence everyone sit straight my microphone sit straight imperative sentence imperative sentence. imperative 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 sentence okay imperative sentence how are you fine thank you interrogative sentences interrogative sentences wow that's a nice book wow, wow. exclamatory sentences uh henry What are the four types of sentences did I tell you now? Entry. What are the four types of sentences I have told now? Uh, 
remember when we were learning uh, pronouns the types of pronouns accusative nominative subjective possessive you all were scared with that these words when you heard of these names you got scared right same way you all are getting scared now it's nothing it's just sentences is just sentences which we are using in our daily life these sentences are called simple sentences these sentences are called simple sentences with the word with the name itself it's a simple sentence so why do you worry so it has one subject we know what is a subject it has one predicate and one finite verb the finite verbs are the verbs which tells us finite verbs are the verbs which tells us about noun Now, no. no. finite verbs tells us about what? Nobody no. remember. Finite, no. finite verbs itself we will tell about the verbs or what? Are fun. Come on, number. No, finite verbs are the verbs which tells us about the tense form of no. the sentence. Forgot? Don't forget. Okay, finite verbs are the verbs which tells us the tense form of a sentence. Okay. So. again coming back to the topic declarative sentences yeah. see now i said finite verbs are the verbs which tells us about the uh, finite verbs are the vo uh, verbs which tells us about the about the again forgot about the uh, tense form of the verb tense form of the and not formulate about the tense with the help of finite verb we can identify the tense of the sentence okay okay so what are the four types of uh, sentences we are going to learn declarative in imperative 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 exclamatory interrogative and exclamatory again declarative declarative imperative Imperative, imperative, interrogative, 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 exclamatory, exclamatory. What are these sentences? Okay, what are these sentences? Declarative sentence. The first sentence is a sentence or statement. A statement. Simple sentence with one subject, one object, or one predicate, or one in one finite verb. Okay. Dia is a good girl. Sarah. Is a smart girl. Isra is jumping on the trampoline. John is climbing the tree. Abel is running behind the kite. Henry is swimming. Rohit is thinking. So these are some small, simple sentences. Yes, statements ending with a. These sentences are ending with a. Um. Full stop. Remember that in sentences, types of sentences, punctuation marks plays a very important role. Plays a very important role, okay? Because it helps us to identify which type of sentence it is. So when I'm telling, Adi Nath has a good haircut. So it's a statement, right? He has a good haircut. Or Henry is leaning on the table. Or Anselin is wearing a green T-shirt. Here I'm giving statements with a full stop, yes or no. So these are called declarative sentences. Okay. In imperative sentences, in imperative sentences, we will give advice. We will give command. We'll give request. request. We'll give order. Order. Okay. Wish. For example, Shiva, stand up. Shiva, stand up. What was it? I don't know. What was it? Command. 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 I can you get a glass of water? Request. Request. May I uh, come in? Order. May I come in? Request. 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 Don't hurt anyone. Advice. 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 Advice.
so whenever we say such sentences it's called imperative sentences imperative sentences can end with a full stop or a question mark if you have seen i have said i'll can you give me a glass of water so in this sentence what will how will i end my sentence uh, with question mark with a question mark may i come in may where exclamatory mark how exclamatory mark will come here question mark question mark question mark shiva stand up come on come on come on ending with full stop full stop hold this book full stop full stop come on then page number 34 Oh, hey, don't open. Was it what it is? Don't open the book. It's just an example. It's just an example. It uh, yes order. Okay, so it's an order. Man, man, can you say all the simple sentences one more time? We will learn. We have two periods today, right? Okay. Yes. Yes, ma'am. So now the first one we learn declarative sentence, which is a statement ending with a full stop. Normal sentences like Adinath is climbing a tree or Arfan is acting like a monkey. See, so, yeah, he opened his mouth. So whenever we are using such statements with one subject, one predicate, and one finite verb, it's called a simple sentence or declarative sentence ending with a full stop now second comes our imperative sentence which is imperative sentences which are ending with a question mark or a full stop it is always a command an order an advice request request or a wish henry open your eyes go wash your face so what it is Come on, Sarah, sit down. I hate seeing this little boy wash his face. Give Because me he's feeling sleepy. Ma'am, give me some chicken curry order. Okay, Shreya, jump on your table. What order? Order. I'm just give using some sentences, right? If I will use some boring sentences, then what will happen after some time? Everybody will be with the pillow, and all the cameras will go off, right? Anupaman, what are the cameras on? Now it's if every Henry is feeling sleepy, the first one. Then after that, everybody will be in the queue. Okay. So the third one comes the interrogative sentences. The interrogative sentences. Asking questions. Asking questions. Interrogative question sentences are asking questions. It is always ending with a question mark. These are direct W H questions or a yes or no type of questions. Also, like John, how are you? Fine. Anselin, how was your day? Good. I did you eat your breakfast? Yes, ma'am. And Vio, did you go out and play? Yes, ma'am. Oh, there. Okay, Shreya, did you take bath? Yes. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Arfan. Yes. Did you set your bre uh, bed? Hmm? No. <laughs> No. <laughs> okay. Um, Jasmin. Yes, ma'am. How did you put this background? I put things. <laughs> so yes. now you all have seen how we frame questions, right? So these questions, the question framing, are called which sentences? Um, interrogative. Interrogative sentences. Okay. And the last one is our exclamatory sentences. The very Easy one because it has a nothing feeling exclamation exclamation mark a sudden feeling a sudden emotion. Sinan, wow, you got the first, you got first rank. Or oh, Anne Maria, good, you scored first or you stood first. Ouch, I got hurt. Uh -huh. Yippee, we won the match. Yeah. 
No, no, no. You're not even giving me examples. Very boring, huh? Mm -hmm. Give some example. Mom, Arfan, I have tell. a doubt. Yes, Arfan, you have a doubt? Uh, he said a question mark in the... Come on, come on. Anupama, switch on your camera. Anupama. Can I tell? Yes. Um, help. I locked myself outside of... Very good. House. Good, 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 good. Rohit. Ma'am, can I say one? Yes. Wow, a wonderful day. Very good. Shiva. Yes. Abel told me that you are having baby. But but that is that today the dad coming up. So it is not a simple sentence. Mom, can okay? I say one? Can I say one? Yes. See, if we are doing when mid one mid, let me complete his sentence. See, in exclamatory sentence, you should have a sudden emotion. Okay. Um, can I say? Oh. Um, can I say? Can we interjection? What? Man. No. Um, no, what can did I say? say? One minute. Interjection. Uh, Ma'am, can I Ma'am, this uh, wow and hooray all are in interjection uh, parts of speech, yes. Ma but can we I are calling say? them as exclamatory Ma sentences, okay? Ma we are calling them as exclamatory sentences. Ma yes, Adidev. Yes, Adidev. Ma can I say? Hooray, the schools are closing. Oh, wow. Ma can I say? Yes, can yes I Prajwal. Ma'am, wow, I won the drawing competition. Very good. Wow. Do you want to say the exclamatory sentence? Yes, I found good morning. Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Good morning. Yeah, vacation is near. Oh, wow. Can You're not tired of vacations now? Yes, sir. How are he? Wow. Okay, now let's one minute. Let me, when let me. they are coming. Okay, mute now. We will revise everything once again. Okay. So, the four types of sentences the first one is declarative sentences. That simply states or declares something, a statement which ends with a full stop. Example, the two white swans are swimming in the pond. The sun rises in the east. The cricket, sorry, cricket is played in, with a bat or in a ball. Imperative sentences, sentences that expresses command, order, advice or request. Imperative sentences can end with can end with a full stop or a question mark. Please come in. Never speak lie. Or let him eat. Then comes interrogative sentences, which are when we ask questions, which you ask questions are called interrogative sentences. It always ends with a question mark. Are you busy? Has the train arrived? When will the class begin? Then comes the exclamatory sentences. Exclamatory sentences expresses some strong or sudden feeling. Example. Oh, what a beautiful beach. Hooray, we have won the match. Alas, he is dead. It is always with the exclamation mark. Okay. Now. Okay, Anupama, I consider your problem. Let me share the screen. I didn't share the screen. Okay. Okay, we are here. Declarative or assertive, imperative, interrogative, exclamatory sentences. Then. Can this be underwriting? No, no, no. Declarative sentences, no, no. declaring sen something, a statement, end with the full stop. We own a cat. I am teaching English grammar. He is watching television. Imperative sentence, request, order, wish, command. Ends with a full stop or a question mark. Feed the cat. Complete these by tomorrow. Be nice to your friends. Here, this is a com uh, command, command, and advice. Asking questions, interrogative, uh, sorry, interrogative sentences. Ends with a question mark. Where is the cat? What is your favorite color? Who is crooking brownies? Exclamatory sentences expressing sudden feelings, make statements with emotions, ends with exclamation marks. The cat is cute. Oh, I forgot about the meeting. We are going to the holiday. 
yippee so these are some examples of exclamatory sentences okay so now tell me what are the four types of sentences we have learned entry <laughs> Um, everyone mute tell henry what are the four types of sentences we have learned henry we just learned right henry shiva Declar declarative. Yes, Arfan. Declarative. First one, first one is said. So second one. Uh, imperative. Declarative, imperative, interrogative, uh, exclamatory. I'll. 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 I'll the yes, all four. Uh, declarative. Declarative. Uh, declarative. Then imperative, interrogative, and exclamatory. Interrogative and exclamatory. Okay, do one thing, everybody. Take your rule paper and write this. <laughs> the four types of sentences. You need to learn the spellings. You need to learn the spellings. Till the time you all write, I'll mark down your attendance. Mom, write and study this. What? Mom, you write and study this. Study yeah, you have to write and study this. And can I write in the book? Yes. Adidev, Adinath, able? We are right to spell the Able, place. present, absent. Ameya. And we are both present. are present. Anselin, present. Anupama, there. Arfan, Ail, Kudres, Dev, Dia. Is present. Eva, Gaurinanda, G. Entry, Isra. Jeswin? John? John, Joseph, and John was there. Joseph, and John Daniel is present. John is present. Joseph is present. Laya is not there. Amil and Sinan both are present. Parvati is there. Ro Prajwal, Rohit, Sarah, Shiva, Shreya, Varadha. So absentees are. Emil, Annabel, Gorinanda, P.S., Laya, Ro, Sapna, and Viraj. These are the absentees. Ma'am, Annabel was there, right? Annabel did not attend the class. She just study. joined and she left. Now, how much time we should write and study? Five times. What is the spelling of uh, declarative I'll? T E C L A R A T I V. Shiva imperative? T e M P E R A T I V E. Adinath, E or I? I heard E. Now it's imperative? No, interrogative. E L T E R G G O G G G R R O G A C I V. Okay. Uh, alpha and exclamatory. X C L A M A T O R Y. Okay. So these are the four types of sentences we have learned today. Okay. In the next class, uh, next class, uh, we'll have a test. Be ready with the test on verbs. Um, uh, formula? No, no, verbs, not formula. There's no formula in verbs. Ma'am, five times? Yes, this will write five times and study the spellings. Each? Yes. Can I stop sharing? No, ma'am. Yes. Yes. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, 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 okay. Right. 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 I was to write. Can stop here.
Uh, did they finish? No, I will write one and then look at and write. Adi, don't write five times now. You can write afterwards. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, okay. now I now um one ma'am, let me write you. Ma'am, I have um left a gap. Now I need to write um all of them just one. Ma'am, I already wrote five times. For what? Okay. Thank you, everyone. Bye bye. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Thank you. Ma Adi, what happened? You still not, did not finish. No, ma'am. I need to write the last two one. All of. This can leave the class. Okay, ma'am. Bye, ma'am. Bye. Bye. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Bye. Take care. Thank you, ma'am. Bye. Thank Thank you, ma bye. Okay, ma'am. Finished. Okay, ma'am. Finished. Okay. Bye, bye, Adi Dev. Bye. Thank you, ma'am. Bye. bye.